minutes through a lot of the news we haven't gotten to. And then Dr. Group's going to take over with Anthony Gucciardi for two and a half hours to take your phone calls to cover health news, world news, uh, other major events. Uh, they're bringing us in the latest news uh, as it breaks today. But Dr. Group, what did you make of the article? That I know I saw you re reading it earlier. Ex-Stasi agent hired to censor xenophobic Facebook post in Germany. The dreaded criminal Stasi uh, that rounded up folks for their speech will now be over arresting people that criticize the radical Islamic invasion. I mean, this is such totalitarianism. Uh, you know, I don't really have too much of a comment on that. It just goes right in line with all the other news that you're seeing every single day. The stuff that you just cannot believe is actually coming out, you know, especially with the harvesting of the organs, the uh, political campaigns, the all of the information, disinformation that's coming out on the media. So what I've really been doing lately is trying to focus on the positive things and what people can do and some of the things that are happening around the world uh, undoubtedly, you know, people up. Undoubtedly, they're trying to accelerate all this because they know human consciousness is expanding, awareness is expanding. Right, I believe that. I mean, it's like the hundredth monkey phenomenon. You know, once you get to a certain point, there's so many people that really do feel um, a positive environment, a positive energy. I guess it's almost like the negative. The people that are real negative are going down even further on the negative path. And the people that are like right in the middle, depending on who they're hanging out with or depending on what they're involved with or maybe moving towards the positive. But I can definitely say that, you know, just from talking to people and kind of observing and doing some research about how all this is affecting, watching different types of videos, understanding. I mean, I've talked to people in the oil and gas industry that would never have even heard of you, for example, or never would have believed any type of so-called conspiracy like something might be happening with the earth that are high-level executives at oil and gas companies. I talked to one the other day that was actually talking about survivalblog.com. So people are, even people that you would never think are getting involved in understanding and that consciousness which is rising and rising and rising i know about waking of, them up i know a bunch of atheists i know folks that are in eastern mysticism i know liberals that are coming to me with tears in their eyes it just happened today and saying it's god and the devil it's good and evil i can feel it i'm scared what do i do and i'm saying don't be scared just yeah. just love god say you want to do the right thing say you're not with the new world order that's all god wants you to do i mean is is just choose a side in your heart yeah, you just have to have faith. It's like we, we used to tell people that came in our cancer clinic with four-stage cancer, they've lost the hope and they've lost the faith because the medical profession with the chemotherapy and radiation has destroyed their immune system, has destroyed their body, and they've lost all hope and they've lost all faith and they've created this fear within themselves. So that's exactly what I tell people is, don't fear. I mean, just have faith and have hope that everything's going to be okay. What else can you do? I mean, you can prepare. You can have some iodine. You can have uh, do some cleansing on your body. You know, all the different things that we talk about. Have a bug out plan. You make sure you have access to clean water. I mean, the whole the list goes on and on, which is great. Everybody should do that. It's good to know about these things because if you don't know about it, it's like how God warned Noah before the flood. You know, we're being, you know, this is what we've devoted our lives to do is to tell people the truth, warn people and let them prepare and give them the things that they need to increase their consciousness. I mean, that's that's how you can create change by increasing consciousness and may, and bringing that awareness back out and giving people the the hope that they can survive. Exactly. That is so important. I'm not here just to scare people. The flood's already coming down the valley. The dam already broke. I'm just saying get to high ground. And that's the good news is we've got time to get ready. Uh, I yeah. wanted to stop this whole thing from happening. But if you live in other countries, I mean, all Hades has already broken loose. We're going to come back, hit some news articles we haven't hit. And then we're going to go to your phone calls. Dion, AD, Chris, Justin, Sonny, and many others. I'm Alex Jones. We've still got 24 plus hours left. One reason we are putting in three different studios. Well, we actually have three studios in right now, but we're dolling one up like this one, uh, the old TV studio. We have the radio studio in there, studio A, B, and C, is that after you've been in here four or five hours with these lights, even with the best air conditioners around, it gets hot. 
Uh, and so at 3 o'clock, you guys for two hours, you and Anthony Gucciardi, who's coming in in 20 minutes, uh, are going to be hosting the show out of Studio A, the original studio. And then, of course, I, myself, and others are going to be coming back, hosting throughout the night. We've got special documentaries that are going to be premiering uh, and more. We're going to have Mystery Science Theater with uh, Jakari Jackson, Leanne McAdoo, David Knight, uh, and others uh, from 8 p.m. to 10 p.m. And then I'll be back with Larry Nichols for an hour. Then we're going to premiere uh, the new Clinton Chronicles 2015. Very powerful. Uh, then we've got Rob Dew with Leo Zagami and others. Uh, we've got Joe Biggs and Darren McBreen and Larry Pinckney. Uh, we've got Joe Biggs, uh, Ryan Smith, and many others. Uh, we have uh, Paul Joseph Watson and a whole bunch of other guests. They're going to be on with him as well, like Syrian Girl, Kit Daniels and Rob Jacobson, uh, Kit Daniels and Mikkel Phelan, Paul Joseph Watson and Rob Dew. Uh, and then, of course, we've also got Leo Gazami exclusive interview and more video premiere demonic possession of the Vatican exposed. I want to get into some other news stories and phone calls with Dr. Group uh, right now. But first, the reason we're doing 28 hours is to produce a whole lot of other media and guests exposing what's happening and to also sell high quality products that help fund this organization and give people a chance to donate. Um, a local PBS station for radio on average like Austin I know they cost about six, seven million dollars a year for them to run that. That's radio with about ten employees. Uh, we've got about forty-five employees, five or six contractors, fifty-plus people to pay. The infrastructure, the bandwidth, the satellites, all of it. It's close to fifteen million dollars a year, and that sounds like a lot of money to somebody that's not in media. That's not. That's the cost of three NPR stations in a city. So we're covering 150 plus big cities, hundreds of small towns, over 170 AM and FM affiliates. We reach 1.6 billion people uh, overall in the social media every year. We reach half a billion every year conservatively on YouTube. Uh, we reach a million people a day on our own podcast, three million with terrestrial radio listeners. We have all the numbers, we've gone over them. And we want to exponentially grow that. Now, most media is folding right now, even with huge audiences, because of the recession here, depression worldwide. We operate out of Texas that is inexpensive. We do a lot of other things, but also we're not about huge profits. See, big companies want something that's small that makes huge profits. They don't want something that is really big but doesn't generate big profits. You see, so we are mission-oriented. Nothing wrong with profits. But we fund ourselves with high-quality products competitively in the open market so we're not beholden to our sponsors. And by beholden, they can't control what we say or do. About 30% of what we do is funded by sponsors. Those are sponsors we handpick that we agree with. And usually I end up just promoting and selling whatever product they have myself if they're a good long-term sponsor. So if you want water filtration, we have 20% off coming up for one hour only. In fact... Uh, you guys were going to bring in, that's that's the one missing link here. I was going to get this morning a whole list of the special promos on items that are only offered during certain times of the day. Uh, other things that are offered 24-7 during this 28-hour special transmission is 20% off Survival Shield Nation Iodine X2, 20% off Super Mel Vitality, 20% off Brain Force, 15% off Deep Cleanse, 15% off Secret 12, 15% off Oxy Powder, and the list goes on and on. You can also simply call directly in to the broadcast, uh, to the studios here, to the great operators, and make a donation or make a purchase. You can also go to InfoWarsStore.com or InfoWarsLife.com and buy products or InfoWars.com forward slash Money Bomb, and you can make a donation. And I want to thank, just randomly here, Matthew uh, Shrive, $20. Heather Overton, $20. Robert Pickett, $20. That's the average. Hugo Ellerston, $100. Eric Jensen, $20. Uh, Brian Driscoll, I hope I'm pronouncing all this right, $30. Ashley uh, Haynes, $100. Dimitri, and I'm not good at reading stuff, I apologize. Uh, that's uh, Michelov, I hope I'm saying it right, $50. Uh, Annette Markin, $20. Uh, Raymond Scherer, $20. David Anderson, $50.
Nancy Hornsby, five dollars. Um, Disseminated Info Mantics, one hundred dollars. Scott Kraft, twenty dollars. Patrick Lacey, twenty dollars. And it just goes on uh, from there. We've got some folks in here that have made thousand dollar donations, four thousand uh, dollar donations. In fact, I had some of those highlighted. Can't find them now. That is what is going to really help us. Four thousand dollars will pay for basically or almost half a month of closed captioning. Quite frankly, I'm all for handicapped folks. I'm all for the, uh, you know, hearing impaired or whatever. Hell, I'm half deaf in one ear. I'll probably need it someday. But what if you're a small media organization that doesn't have $120,000? That's the cheapest for five hours a day of closed captioning that we have to do to be on TV satellites. That's federal law. That's how they use the Americans with Disabilities Act to bankrupt people. So we're trying to get on television in a kosher way to, to reach people. That's 120,000 smackers on the barrel head in a year-long contract that's signed. You have the satellite in? $400,000 for five hours over the next year. And let's just start adding everything else up. That's why a million dollars is not a lot of money. The globalists have the money. That's why they've been able to enslave us. That's why I'm making an attempt, and everything else we've been doing is successful, praise God, to try to go to that next level and beam down to North America. And when it's successful, and I believe it will be, thanks to your support, your prayers, all the rest of it, then we're going to target Europe. Then we're going to target Africa. We're going to target the Middle East. We're going to target free to air Asia. You're talking about a couple million dollars a year to do that, and I have committed to do it. Uh, even if I have to spend the emergency money in the bank, even if I have to sell my house, when it comes time, when this new syndication thing is working and operating, I will expend every amount of backup capital we've got. But 100% of the capital uh, that, that comes into this money bomb will go directly to the radio slash TV syndication and reaching so many new people. And hopefully that'll have enough profit from the moderate advertising we have to then pay for the satellites all over the world and so much more. So Infowars.com forward slash Moneybomb. Send that link to all your friends and family via email, Facebook, and Twitter. Like our post on our main Facebook channel right now. We'll show you that. And what you can do as the people is unstoppable. And I want to salute all of you that have been supporting us. All right, because we're all in this together. Dr. Group. I see you have loaded phone lines there, and we'll wait till Anthony's in. You guys are in the, um, well, he'll be in this studio for 30 minutes, and you'll move into that one afterwards. And I've got a special message to affiliates we're going to air at the start of the next hour. There's a lot of other surprises coming up. But, uh, Dr. Group, just you're sitting there listening to me rant. What is your view on how key it is to get behind truly independent media? Well, just like you said, I don't think people understand the real costs of media, and it's designed that way, obviously, because they any then everybody would about be out there telling the truth. So they do try to suppress anybody from getting on TV, and I'm just real happy to to help out and to be a part and to offer some of the best, well, the best products in the world for your listeners, and glad to be a part of something that's really can change the world. I mean, being able to get this information out to 400 million people just just getting on television uh it is extremely expensive uh the sales that you have going on right now are extremely good i mean we have all these things that are happening i mean this month right here is a groundbreaking month in history of the world i mean we have apparently all these things that are happening all these good things are happening you're getting on tv people are getting healthy people are waking up incredible specials uh, at InfoWarsLife.com. You get 20% off. Now is the time to stock up. It's a perfect time. You know, 20% off your, and free shipping. Free shipping. Stock up on the X2, the Brain Force, Super Male Vitality. Go through there. You're making a good donation. One million is hardly anything to keep the show going. And I know you personally, and I know that you put everything into this organization. And I've, you know, we even try to get the highest quality products and well, let's just go off record. You, you've you given me even bigger hey, discounts, even though you yeah. don't make a lot of profit. It's not the profit's yeah. bad. You yeah. need to have that. But but we're all in to go to this next level. It's, it's not, group. Exactly. That's what it is. It's all about, I feel like I was born on, and put on this planet to help humanity. You feel like you were born to help humanity. We've both done that, and we've both 
done that in many different ways. And now look at all the other people that are out there doing that. It's just bringing high